Hi Readers has a math book to share with you today. It's one of my favorites. I've read this book a lot to students, and I have a feeling that some of you have probably heard this book from me. Is To a Lot by Annie Watson. Do you remember this book? If not, do you think two is a lot? Hmm, let's find out. Is two a lot? One day, Joey had a very important question. Is two a lot, he asked his mommy. His mommy thought for a moment, then she said, well, two is not a lot of pennies, but two is a lot of smelly skunks. Ew. What about three, Joey asked. Is three a lot? Well, Joey, his mommy replied, I'd say three is not a lot of books on the shelves. Do you think you have more than three books on your shelf? I do. But three is a lot of broken bones. Ouch. I've never broken a bone. What about four, asked Joey? Is four a lot? His mommy smiled. Four is not a lot of children on a school bus, she answered. But it is a lot of dogs to walk at once. Have you ever had to walk that many dogs? I think I've only ever walked two dogs. What about five, asked Joey. Hmm, well five is not a lot of freckles, said his mom. Do you have freckles? I have freckles on my nose. But five is a lot of cowboys on a city street. That would be surprising to see. How about 10, mommy? I had a feeling that was com coming, said his mommy. I'd say 10 is not a lot of pieces of popcorn but it is a lot of clomping dinosaurs. Like they're feeding the dinosaur popcorn. Ugh. What about 50, asked Joey. Is 50 a lot? That's a hard one, Joey. Let me see, I'd say 50 is not a lot of leaves left on the aspen tree, but it is a lot of letters in a mailbox. I would love to get 50 letters in my mailbox. This time, Joey was sure he could stump his mommy. What about 100? Mommy paused for a moment and then said, 100 is not a lot of snowflakes. Look at that pile there. Maybe 100 snowflakes would even fit in your hand. But 100 is a lot of candles on a cake. Whoa. Do you know anyone who's lived to be 100? I do not. Maybe I will live to be 100. Maybe you will live to be 100 too. Joey took a deep breath and thought hard. Then he asked, Mommy, what about 1,000? Is 1,000 a lot? Mommy said, you ask great questions. I'd say 1,000 is not a lot of grains of sand. Ooh, here's 1,000 grains of sand. But again, I think like the snowflakes, 1,000 grains of sand might fit right in your hand. But 1,000 is a lot of hot air balloons. Whoa, look, they even have the dinosaur. Joey was quiet for a long time. Then his mommy asked him, so what do you think, Joey? Is two a lot? Joey answered, well, sometimes two is a lot. And sometimes it is not. What do you see two of in this picture? Two members of their family with a nice big hug. What a sweet ending. Look at this hot air balloon. Can you read what it says? I love books. I would ride in that hot air balloon. I hope you enjoyed is too a lot. Look around you. What do you have a lot of? Or what do you have that is a big number, but it's a small amount of items? What about pencils? What about erasers? What about staples? Have you ever seen staples all lined up? I don't know how many staples are there together, but you can count them and see if, is it a lot? Anyways, keep reading, find math books, find creative books and silly books and scary books and snorty books, whatever kind of books you want. And I will see you next time. Bye readers.